Hello everyone. Today in this post we would like to compare two basic forces of the nature that is electric force and gravitational force. We know gravitational force exists between every two particles because every two particles are definitely having certain mass. Every particle is having a certain mass. Therefore, gravitational force exists between masses. For electric force to exist, it is not only the mass that is required, even the charge is also required. So we can say this uh, electric force is due to that of the charges, it exists between the charged particles. So it is very clear that uh, every two particles will definitely have a gravitational force, but electric force will be there only when the particles are having a certain mass, otherwise it is not possible. Then gravitational force is always attractive force, they never repel, two bodies because of the gravitational force will never repel, whereas electric force may be attractive or sometimes even repulsive, we know similar charges repel each other and opposite charges get attracted with the, each other. Gravitational force is medium independent, that means Whatever may be the medium in between the two masses, the gravitational force is going to remain same even if you change the medium, whereas electric force is not medium independent rather it is medium dependent. Whenever the medium changes, gravitational force between them is also going to be changed. Both of them are long range forces, there is no difference between them, both of them are long range forces acts for a very long distance. Gravitational force the being treated like a fundamental force is the weakest force of the nature. Electric force is much stronger than the gravitational force. Of course, it is not strongest, we have a nuclear force, but gravitational force is a weaker force when compared with the electric force. Both are central forces, that means they act towards that of the center of the nucleus. These are the basic comparisons of the gravitational force. Both of them follows, there is another rule that we can say both of them follows, obeys inverse square law. That means the force of attraction or repulsion is inversely proportional to the square of the distance of the separation. We can say gravitational force is capital G m1 m2 by r square according to Newton's law of gravitation, whereas electric force f is equal to 1 by 4 by epsilon naught, where epsilon naught is called as permittivity of the medium q1 and q2 by r square. These are the comparisons of the two forces. Thank you. We will continue this discussion in the next post.